first of all, let's get to this energy and how lovely things are right now and what's going on. Okay, let me just show you guys my silk bed sheets that I just got. Look at these bed. Look at this bed. It's all silk. It's all golden silk. Look at this. Silk and golden everywhere. Like a queen. Oh. Yes, I am a queen. Hold on. Let me put up the brightness. Hold on. First of all, I want to tell you guys that luck is coming in for a lot of people. A lot of good things are coming in. And another thing I want to share with you guys, those of you who are like, oh, I want to come to the retreat before 95 is too expensive. Lucky you. I just made something happen for you. Those people who want to come to the retreat, but you can't pay 495 and you're in the New York area and you can get there with no problem. We're allowing people to come for like 200, but you're not guaranteed a bed. That's the only thing. You're not guaranteed a bed. So you can get like a sleeping bag. There's couches there. It's a big house. We'll find somewhere for you to sleep. But just letting you know, those people who are paying the full price, they get the comfortable beds and to relax. But those people who still want to come and experience the healing and the readings and all that stuff uh, for $200, I would go and sleep on the floor. I wouldn't give a shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The broken, please don't. Don't talk about that stuff on my life. There's no fighting in my life, okay? Everybody, it's all love and light. So I'm just letting you guys know if you're in the New York area. Uh, why does everybody keep saying join Bad Girls Club? What is, why does that keep coming up? What's, what's going on with that? Why well, everybody keeps talking about that? But I just want to let you go, let, let you know that. So come then. Then come. Pay the 200 and come. That's crazy. 495 compared to 200 And like I said, that's for the people who don't mind, like, not, um, you know. And also, you may not be guaranteed to get, like, a mini reading. But you'll get a mini reading from somebody. Probably me. Because <laughs> that's, that's how I am. But either way, you'll get the sound bath healing, the astrology. We'll get um, guided meditations, the cleansing, the, the ceremony, the healing, and all that stuff, okay? Yeah, Zeus needs my light. And Zeus... I know why they're saying go to Bad Girls Club because Zeus wants me there. But Zeus, I'm not coming. You're already... Me and Zeus, we beefing. We be beefing because, you know, he's a hoe. I'm just kidding. <laughs> he's a hoe. Yeah. Yeah. You're ready for the full experience? Then you guys should come then. If you're in, if you're in the... Well, first of all, not only if you're in the area. I got people coming from... One's coming from Arizona. Another one from Pittsburgh. Another person's driving five hours from where North Carolina. I'm not sure where they are, but they're coming. Okay, yeah, you know, do you do one on ones? Yeah, not right now though. Not right now. I I am very generous, giving people an opportunity to join the retreat and come because I know that people want to come. You know what I'm saying? And I see like a lot of people are hitting me up like, "Damn, Flo, I wish it wasn't 495. I really would have come, but." Hey, listen, four ninety five to me is fair compared to I paid almost twenty eight hundred for that place to rent it for one fucking night, okay, with the service fees and all that. Love and light, but like I gotta keep it real, you know what I'm saying? I gotta also make money too, you know? Being and then I gotta pay those two girls that are coming. I gotta pay the sound bath healer for her time, I gotta pay the astrologer for her time. I can't just be like Oh, I'm dad, we didn't make money, you're doing this for free, you know what I'm saying? But then it's a learning curve for all of us too, you know? Yeah, someone can still join. Yes, it's August 24th through the 25th. This is why I told the other girls to continuously post this because people don't always see the posts. They just like don't pay attention. August 24th and 25th, you come in there the 24th, you're checking out the 25th. And not only that, after you guys check out the people who are down, we can go to lunch, hang out for an hour or two because I got people that are coming from out of town. I'll take, I'll, we'll go out to lunch. We'll, you know, we'll get something to eat. We'll talk for a while instead of just running home right after the retreat. But uh, some people want to go right home. It doesn't matter. You know, it's in Wallkill, New York. Wallkill, New York. It's by upstate New York. If you know where Woodbury Commons is, Bear Mountain State Park, it's in that area. Like, it's not far from there. It's like 15, 20 minutes, 25 minutes from there. So, yeah. From where I'm at, it's like 25, 30 minutes. And then there's people driving hours to come. Like, it's a it's a road trip, but you're staying overnight. It's not like you're coming and then you have to leave that day. You stay overnight. So, if you did drive, you always have a place to rest your head at. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. If you didn't know about the retreat, come on, guys. I've been posting about This is why I continuously post and post and post and post. This is why. Because some people don't see it. They don't see it. Anyway, like I said, it's four ninety five. We still have the four ninety five spots available. But if <clears throat> push comes to sho shove, and there's people who are like, I really want to come, but you know, like they're they're okay with not like getting a bed, actual bed to sleep. Well, shit, I'll sleep on the floor with you. I don't care. Um, 
and they're okay with like maybe the astrologer not giving them a reading or maybe I can't, we don't have time for it, then they're okay with that. But they still get all of the healing benefits, which is like the ceremonies, the burning ritual, the clearing, the clearing of the body, mind and souls. You're going to be there for the channeling session, which I'm going to channel energy and we're going to connect with their... I have white nail polish. Only white. I think Nana has in the in the closet. Ask her. She has some nail polishes what over there. Closet. As she knows. Ask her. Nana, do we have nail polish? You can cuddle with me. You know I'm. Th come, please come. Come on. I want you to come, Desiree. Come out there, please. You will fucking love it, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna make sure you guys have a good time. If you want me to eat your butt after, I won't. I'm just kidding. I'm joking. Blech. <laughs> not butt <laughs> I won't eat your butt <laughs> maybe your vagina no I'm just kidding depending how cute you are no, I'm just kidding <laughs> what if I end up hooking up with what if I meet the woman of my dreams there what if I fall in love with the woman of my dreams at my retreat <laughs> that would be great Kiana are you coming so Kiana won the raffle I could do another raffle but I have to charge $30 a person for the raffle because I need to cover the full expenses of the person attending. So let's say if I do another raffle and somebody could win. I mean, <clears throat> so come, Ultra Violet Creations. Come, come, come. I don't know why you guys are not coming. Listen, I get it. Listen, four ninety five dollars The least, the 400 is the least. That I let one person come for 400 because she's coming from Arizona. So I was like, I'll let you come for 400 you know what I'm saying? And she did. She was like, that's awesome. You know, $95 I could use that for the hotel and, and uh, you know, and she don't have to rent a car because I'm picking her up from the airport, which I would do if somebody flies out. I'll put, pick you up from the airport as long as it's at Newark Airport and it's just within the same times that she's getting picked up, which is at 12. I'm picking her up like 12, 30, 1 o'clock. I'll be there. As long as you work with me, I'll work with you. You guys know how I am. I'm not going to let you just come here and be like, I don't know how to get there. Like, help me. Uh, like, I'm going to make sure you're good. <laughs> yeah, wall kill New York. I'm just make sure I can, I come. I'm, I'm going to make sure I come. Kiana, yeah, just try to get your flight to come back in Newark. Listen to this. This is important. Try to get your flight to come back in Newark around 12, 31 o'clock in the afternoon. Because if you do, Newark, 12, 31 o'clock, I could pick you up and then try to get it to go back but the next day by 1 or 2 p.m. No, by 4 p.m. or 5 p.m. Because then I could take you both back to the airport, too. I, I would come, but I literally can't right now. I get it, man. It's not easy. I would tell you guys something. I'm going to tell you something, and this is for real, true to, to the core. If it was me, I would definitely go on a 495 retreat right now. I've been looking for one to go myself, but they're all, these bitches are all talking about two, $3,000. I'm like, are you going to eat my asshole when I get there? Like, wait, hold on. <laughs> are you serving, like, lobsters and all that? And plus, you know, even the food part, I'm not going to make that a big deal for the retreat. It's going to be more like either we're just going to grab pizza or salads or... We're not going to, it's not about food. We're going there to heal and do that stuff. I'd like to keep our stomach light. I would love for everybody to fast and then we'll eat something light at night and drink some smoothies and stuff. But I just want people to, um, you know, to, to not feel hungry either. Cause some people, they can't fast. Some people are like, bitch, I'm starving. <laughs> There's so many great things happening for everybody right now. Too bad I'm not in the U.S. 490. Oh, by the way, oh, guys, so those of you guys who can't attend, remember, there's a Zoom link that I'm going to be sending to people who pay $45, uh, $55, and they can join, like, the healing circles and, and the when we talk to each other. I don't want to tell you guys everything I'm doing, but what I can say is that there's, like, for the Zoom link, you're going to be sitting there, like, with us in a circle and doing some things that we're doing when we're there. Some of the stuff is, like, it's a mystery. We're not telling anybody. Four ninety five is a steal. I've looked at retreats too, and they're definitely up in the thousands. They are, man. More information, please. My daughter and I want to come. Okay, so the information is this. First of all, um, it's three women that I brought together. I'm hosting the retreat. I rented an Airbnb. I'll show you guys here. Hold on, so you could look because those people were just tuning in. I'll show you here. Okay. Uh, I don't know what can I show you the the front of the house. I guess. Let's just show this because it shows the whole thing. Hold on. One second, one second, one second. Where the fuck is the picture of the house? Uh, wow. I can't find the picture of the Okay. This is the house. Okay. It's got a jacuzzi in the back and a pool in the back. Okay. This is in Wallkill, New York. And this is obviously you see that it's like entrance there. And there's like a beds everywhere. 
uh, jacuzzi and a pool in the backyard. So, which I'm definitely jumping in both of them. I don't care what anybody says when it's all done. I'm definitely, yeah, please guys, if you want to do the zoom, if you want to do the zoom, please email me here. Yeah, that shit was expensive. Wow is right. It better be wow. That's why I got it because it was a wow for me. I was like, when I saw it, I was like, God damn, this house looked big as hell. So if you got any questions or you want to know anything, please, okay? Do you see my pinned comment? Please hit me up right there. Angels in training 111 at gmail.com if you want to know more, you want to talk more. Even if you want me to call you and talk about it and you want to be comfortable and talk to me about it, and I'll definitely give you a call and do that. It's not until the 24th and the 25th. You still have two and a half weeks until the retreat. There's not, there's no rush. I've been, I just booked, listen, I'm going to tell you guys this how this happened. Spirit was like, do it. And I was like, I'm scared though. That's a lot of money, blah, blah, blah. And then I just booked the house, which I literally paid almost $3,000 for, by the way. <laughs> this just stresses me out. <laughs> this just stresses me by the way. <laughs> me rubbing my eye shows you how stressed out I am about that, okay? Because I'm afraid, like, what if I don't make the money back? What if people don't come? But so far, like, five people are confirmed and they're coming. So that's that's good. I'm also letting one person come for free because she's she went through a hell this whole year. So I'm allowing that. And then one person is the winner. So that's two people I'm missing out on $500 almost for each. So I have to, you know, book other people. I got to do it because I'm very kind and very giving. And then on top of that, there's some people who are like, I can I pay you 400 and I'll owe you 95 or can I pay you 370 and I'll pay you the rest? Yes, you can. As long as you pay me back, I don't care. If you're like Flo, I got 300 right now. I promise you the week after, a month later, I'll pay you back the rest of the 200. I don't care. Then do that. Then do that. As long as you come, why are you going to miss out? Because you're afraid to ask me if you could pay me back later. If you don't pay me back later, that's your karma, not mine. <laughs> like, I'm not going to lose nothing. I'm going to, the spirit's going to take you away from my life, which will, it will cost me $200 to lose you forever. You know? It's not the money that's derived from me. Yeah, bro, listen. That's why I say fuck with me. Because I'm not other people. I want you guys to come because I want you to come. It's not about the money. I don't give a, f a flying fuck if I don't even make the money back. Because guess what, bitch? I'll throw a party in that motherfucker that day. And bitches, a jacuzzi, a pool. I'll invite some people. We'll be chilling. I don't care. Either way, oh, wow, I lost out on $2,800. Oh, my God, I'm going to die. You got to take risks, right? So I don't care. Either way, I'm that house is being used that night. Trust me when I tell you, but I don't want to use it for that reason. But if I have to, if I have to really get twisted and drink and go in the jacuzzi and pool, I will. I don't care, but I won't do that. It's not going to happen. So what's going to happen is people are coming. I already got five people confirmed. They paid one person paid up front. There's a few people that are still, they paid the, the down payment, which is 150 to pay the down payment. That's securing your spot, right? You have still another two and a half weeks to put the down payment or to pay it. So if you, let's say you got a job and you make 700 a week, you pay all your bills. If you could put 200, 200, another 200 away from now till then, you can come to the retreat. Even if you hit me up last minute and be like, Flo, like, can I still come? Yes. Like, I will sleep on the floor just so you have a bed to sleep in. Do you understand? And I said men can come too, but, you know, as long as they're there for healing and not for any other purpose. Because, you know, it, I'll do, don't worry, we'll do hookup stuff too. We'll get dating um, situation things happening too. But this is for healing. So if you're coming for healing purposes and you need to heal and you feel comfortable being with a bunch of women or may, you might be the only man, that's okay too. It is. Thank you, Kitty. Thank you. Where are you from, Ultraviolet? Where are you from? Because there's people coming from Brooklyn. Another girl's coming from Pittsburgh. One is from North Carolina. Bro, I'm shocked that people are flying in for this. I'm like, oh my God. They're coming from that far. You know how good that makes me feel? Like, it makes me so happy. Christy, I wish you could come. So, did you get that money saving box? Yes, I did. I got it. It's over there. Oh, I forgot. Thank you. I forgot I put some money in there. I'm from up north more, like Albany. Like Albany, New York? Bitch, there's gotta be a train or a bus to take it to Harry Man, New York. If you guys are wanting to know, this is where a train would come and I'd pick you up from here if you're taking a train from anywhere, New York City or anywhere. But that's that's my email address. Save it so you can um so you can um email me if you have questions, please, okay? Because I can answer them for you so you feel more confident and comfortable, obviously. Like I said, um, 
the two hundred dollar people, like if I let people come for two hundred, that's towards the end of the retreat. If you're like, oh, I got two hundred, I want to come, let me hit up flow. That's it. But for now, it's four ninety five. But if you're like really want to come and you really need healing and your flow, please, I will sleep on the floor. I don't care. There, you probably don't have to sleep on the floor because there's couches everywhere and shit. So look into it. What number should I play? Seven nine five. I'm going to tell you something about that. You said, what number should I play? Look, we see 33 people in the room. One time I posted, I was like, 818, 818. I keep seeing 818. And it was my friend's dad's birthday. Do you know that number hit that day? And she played that number every day, but that day she didn't. This is a true story, bro. Yeah, so come. Ultraviolet looks like your soul is mad radiant too. You need to come. Look, I got all these fucking silk shits on my bed. I'm so excited right now. <laughs> so I got a shit. Doesn't it look like one like gold wrapper? <laughs> like a wrapper. You know, I love it. Oh, God. Somebody's cooking onions and it stinks. It stinks like onions. I hate it. Let me go outside. I feel like this is going to be such a good Mercury in retrograde. I usually hate Mercury in retrograde. Not hate it, but I usually can't stand Mercury in retro. But I feel like this one's going to be a good one. Let me go out. Look at my skin, guys. Isn't it looking great? I'm so proud of myself. I went from some fucked up skin to like, yay, my skin looks nice. What is this? Yo, that's mad weird. I just came in the bathroom where I keep my cigarettes and one of them is like ripped up and thrown there. That's fucking weird. Who did that? Mm -hmm. Can I tell you guys a secret? So this girl was like, she goes to me. Uh, no, I'm on the phone, sorry. This girl goes to me. She goes, Flo. She's like, Flo, can I just offer you some advice? This random bitch that, like, I don't even know like that. <laughs> Look at my grays already coming in. Can I offer you some advice? I was like, sure, why not? Yeah, I, I always take advice. She said, maybe you should stop being a little, like, don't be so ghetto for the retreat, like, when you're talking. Try to, like, not talk like you do all the time, and, like, maybe more people will be attracted to the retreat. I said, bitch, they're coming for the ghetto. What the fuck is wrong with you? What are you talking about? They're coming because I am like this. What? You want me to pretend? I'm like, hey, I may reach I can't even do the fake voice. Look. Hi. I'm flo no. It's like, I can't even. Yes, this bitch said, maybe try not to talk like so ghetto. And more people will come to the retreat. I'm like, bitch, I got pe people coming. There's plenty. It's booking up. Like, within two days, five people signed up and sent me money. <clears throat> she did so, Patty. She did. <laughs> she did. And I said, sir, I'm so sorry. I don't know what world you come from, but if you don't realize, they follow me because of my personality, and that's why people want to come to my retreat, because they don't feel uncomfortable. And it's not some perfect-looking bitch who's like, mm -hmm. you need to be more like me and stay calm. You all the bitch fucking does nasty shit behind the camera. It's like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> the fuck that's why i'm able to heal people because i'm gangster what the fuck is wrong with you that's why spirit don't fuck with me they're like please not her god she's annoying she'll never stop she'll come after us for the rest of eternity you know what i'm saying tell me why i moved to an apartment that is surrounded by trees that i haven't been able to see the moon but on my birthday it was sitting on my couch and look up and see the full moon my retreat is in Wallkill, New York. Wallkill, New York. Australia, those of you guys who are out of state, out of country, if you want to support the retreat and just be a part of it somehow, you're going to have the Zoom link. $50, or I'm not sure what they said, but it's, I think 50 is fair. I was still trying to go for 45 but you know what? Let's do 45 50 is too... It's, I'm sorry. See, this is my problem. That's why I... I got to learn to be a good businesswoman. 45 is a good price, though, to be on Zoom for like an hour and be a part of the retreat and be a part of the healing, the sound bath or the ceremony, whatever one. So 45 for the Zoom link. So you, I could put my camera and my phone there and you guys can pretty much be involved with everything we're doing. You know, you could feel like you're there for a while with us. You know what I mean? What's your take on somatic messages? Yeah, and you know what's funny? The second she said that to me, maybe if you try not to speak so ghetto, more, your retreat will have more appealing people. No, it will appeal different types of people. The way I speak is the way I speak, and people love me for it. And I love myself for the way I am. I've worked very long and hard to accept myself for the assertiveness that I have, you know, 
inquire through my lifetime through you know through stuff like a lot of people they find me aggressive but i'm not aggressive that's the thing i'm just really honest and to them that's weird but like honesty is what we're supposed to be doing and then she said to me then some girl called me that day the one coming from arizona she goes bitch and i didn't even say nothing so she goes i'm coming because i saw you on live and you were doing that that uh ritual thing with the candle she goes you were smoking a cigarette she was like that's it this is my soul sister i'm going i was like yes she's like i booked the flight that second i was like are you serious you you just booked it she's like yeah and i sent you the deposit she goes i'm not gonna lie after i was like oh my god should i have done this and then i talked to her on the phone she was like this is why i fucking love you like she was like you're like my sister and i was making sure like, I'm making sure she's good with the hotel. I even told her I'll take $50 off the retreat thing so you can put it towards the hotel. Yo, I'm not. You guys understand. I wouldn't make that. That'll be clear, clear. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's like, I love people. You see what I'm saying? If I could do a retreat for $50 and have everybody come, you think I wouldn't do that? But I can't because I got to pay for things. I'm paying people. Like, this time is different. This is not just me. So I can't charge $250 for the retreat because I'm paying two other people. So, and they, you know, they want, they wanted 300 each. I talked them down to a little less, you know what I'm saying? <clears throat> but I don't blame them. <clears throat> you know, they charge a lot for their services personally, so why not? Be A one hour reading with me is 375 so I don't care if people are like, that's a lot of money. Okay, well, I do a lot of work. <laughs> so it's like, you're gonna get a reading plus healing from me for 495 that's insane and yo one thing i told the other girls because they're more like calm or like you know all right it's cool like they're like more like get involved with your soul and they're very like i love that about them because they're different from me you know they got more like that professionalism going on i'm, I'm more like no come here what the fuck's wrong with you we're gonna take it out of you right now i want you to sit here and i want you to act like you're throwing these motherfuckers up whatever entities you have throw them motherfuckers up and i'm gonna pull that fucking darkness out of you and i'm gonna throw that shit somewhere else and when you leave the retreat i want you to be the happiest carefree person in the world just like many people who've tried to come to my retreats and spirit try to stop them so on the last retreat i did in, in newark new jersey which another one which when I booked the place, like it looked real nice in the pictures and it didn't end up being that great in person, but everybody still loved, we had such a good time. We, we did shrooms at the end of the retreat. <laughs> we took shrooms at the end. I never did it before. So I want to see, <clears throat> what was it like, you know? Luna, get out of here. Get, 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 get out of there. Get your ass out of here. Get, 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 get. She loves being outside when it's wet. Look at her, this place is a mess. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Nigeria, Ooh. you could come to the uh, Zoom Zoom retreat. So what happens is when you pay the Zoom link, right now, if you guys were to go and pay the Zoom link, if you look at my post with the retreat on the bottom, it gives you the information, my PayPal, my, my Cash App, and my Zelle. If you send $45 to that, you're automatically involved in the retreat. So I'm going to have you guys send me whatever money the 45 you send me right it's supposed to be 55 but i'll do 45 the 45 you send me just write your name and text your number or your whatsapp because i have a whatsapp now because i realized i talked to a lot of people from china and all that stuff because of tiktok i work with people from out of the country anyway you send that and you write your your phone number or your whatsapp i'll text you and i'll be like hey this is going to be the link for the zoom for the for the retreat so on august 24th and the 25th you'll have it for two days the first day and the second day so you'll have like the beginning of the retreat and then the end of the retreat. You'll be on there for like an hour each time, each day. Hour the night before, hour the day before for $45. That's why they wanted to do 55 because it's going to be for both days. But if you want to send 55, you can, but I'm making it 45. So those of you who really can't come and you really just want to come. And also towards the end of the retreat, let's say a week or two from now, I post. If I fucking post, hey guys, we're accepting people. $200 a person for the retreat. Just You're not guaranteed a bed and not guaranteed a reading, but most likely you'll get one. But you're not guaranteed. But I got to say you're not guaranteed because just in case shit gets too busy and I'm like, like let's say I say it's 200 and like 10, 15 more people say they're coming. You know, that would um, be a lot of people, you know. But anyway, we're still going to do the readings. I'm going to sit on my channel. I'm going to channel. You know how uh, Teresa does and she sits there and the people sit there and spirit comes through, family members and all that. That's what I'm going to do. Like, I'm going to let family members come through. We're gonna, Not only that, you're going to be doing readings. Yes, the fuck you are. Yes, you are. You're not just going to sit there and stare at me. I'm like, who could do readings in here? Who's a healer? Stand up. My eyes look sick right now. Look at this. This is no feel like sick. 
Yo, my eyes look like fucking sick cat eyes right now. That's how I know I'm part cat. So like I said, those of you who are like, four ninety five is too much for me, Flo. There's just so you know, towards the end, like in a week from now. So save 24th and 25th of August. Take that on your calendar and block it. Because just in case you do have 200 and let's say last minute you run into $500 and you're like, yo, fuck that, I'm going. And you pay the 200 and you're near New York or you can get there with no problem. You let me know and I'll put you in the retreat because I'm a fucking beast. The retreat is August 24th and 25th. So it's overnight sleeping uh, retreat. For food, I'm going to probably do something like, okay, some people like, I cook. Can I bring fried rice? Uh, can I bring um my my rice and beans? Hell yeah, you can, bitch. I love rice and beans. You, you, you know how to cook. Bring some food if you're really an, a good cook and a clean cook. Make sure you're clean because I will smell the food. And if I smell something off, I'm not eating it, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I know I'm lying. I'm leering. Because you know how cats have like those perfect like eyes. That, I, I mean ears that go like push. Look at my ears. They just stay perfectly. Look how perfect they look. They just stay like attached to my head. Like they're, they're per I love my ears. You know, people say, what do you like about you? My eyes and my ears. It's weird, but it's the truth. You hear from Facebook? Hey. Yay. Because I don't be going on Facebook like that because people are weird there. They get mad weird. Everybody's so personal there. Clear. Thank you. I would love to see you guys there. Ultraviolet, bitch. Find out if there's a train. I'll pick you up from the train station. To Harriman, New York. Okay? Anybody who wants to find out August 24th and August 25th. Okay? Harriman, New York. This is the train station I could pick you up at. August 24th to the 25th. Okay? And then the next day, we could chill for a while. We could go somewhere. I could take you guys around. The email, please write that down. Angelsintraining111 at gmail.com. Gypsy, I'm fucking gypsy too, bro. 100%. You know how many dreams I've had of me being a gypsy child? And I was a performer. I would sing and stuff. Hold on. Let me um, let me do this now. Hold on. All right. Here, I pinned that. Okay. Yeah. How possible is it to be a gypsy from Nigeria? It's very rare. Very rare. But there are a lot of them in Nigeria, actually. There's the, there's the snake gypsies. I don't know if you've ever heard of them, but look them up. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I was a gypsy too. I actually got sold as a child when I was a gypsy in one lifetime. They showed me why I have like childhood trauma a lot because I was sold off like to another family. Like they, they, I was singing. I was a singer. I played the guitar and all that. So yeah, there's geese. There's a lot of geese here. They're all over the place, and they leave shit like this big everywhere. They're so cute, but they're so annoying. Okay not annoying for the email for the email is angels just like it's written angels in training 111 at gmail.com dot com okay and that's for any questions for any questions okay and then retreat dates let me just do this real quick august 24th through the 25th okay um and then it's uh, the train station nearby I could pick you up at is Harriman, New York. Okay, let me just I put that all at once so you could have it there. And like I said, towards the end of the retreat, I'm going to allow people to come for like 200 bucks, okay? And if you have like 250 280 you want to donate later on, you can. But if you really like, I really want to go flow, but I can't afford it. I got you. Just talk to me. If you let's say you want to come to this retreat, just let me just say something. You really want to come to the retreat. You you know you could pay two fifty right now, and like two fifty the end the middle of September. You know you can pay it though. Like you're not I'm, whatever two fifty and then uh, like one hundred and twenty after that, right? Let's say towards the end of September, you're like, I know I'll have that money again, and you're like, Flo, can I pay you two fifty now? And I swear to God, I'll pay you in the end of September. Yeah, I'll just. I'm not going to write a contract with you and be like, oh, you owe me. It's up to you to pay that money back. And if you don't, that's on you. Everything we do is karma. So you, you shit on somebody like me, you're shitting on yourself, not me. I'm not going to put no spells on you. You know I don't do that. But, you know, the universe has a funny way of fucking you in the ass. You know what I'm saying? So don't fuck me in the ass and I won't fuck you in the ass unless that's what you like. Then I could truly fuck you in the ass and I have no problem with that. I'll wear a strap on it and everything. Is there an airport near the area? Yeah, well, Newark, Newark Airport. If you were to fly in to Newark Airport, I will be picking you up. 
Now, I, I do want to say one thing. There is a girl who's staying for like two other days and she's trying to book herself a room. So if any of you guys like want to share a room with her, let me know and I'll, t I'll write to her. But better, you're going to, that's what I'm saying. You're going to come to the retreat. It, we can't go there till 4 p.m. because the bitch was like $80, $80 an hour if you want to open up early. It, bitch, what? I'm not paying you $80 more. I, pay, I already paid you $2,890 something dollars for that house for one night. The fees, the cleaning fees, service fees were $680 alone. Okay? And then she wants to charge me $80 on top of it. If that place ain't the flyest shit, because it looks really nice in the pictures. If it ain't the flyest shit, that's what we're doing. We're staying in the Airbnb. That's what I, that's what I got, Airbnb. If it's not the flyest place, place in the world best believe i'm gonna leave the sickest worst review on on earth like this bitch woo, woo. yeah but I, it looks really nice it looks so good on look <clears throat> on the fucking thing it looks amazing like you know what i'm saying that's that's i didn't get it for no reason that's why i didn't mind paying that price it's like anyway like so don't let it go just let it be Love like a magazine, we got so many fucking issues Do you still think about me? Cause I still think about you It's crazy how I knew my life would be this bad without you Mama told me that love could kill And for you, girl, you know I will Come let it go Just let It's awesome, like, I, this is the biggest one I'm doing so far Usually when I book the retreat, the Airbnbs, it's usually like $800 for the night this one was almost three grand. And I'm telling you that for a reason because it was a big investment for me. And I was terrified. Not like terrified, but I was like, oh, God, what if I don't make no money back? But I know I will. Anyway, I'm doing another raffle, but this time the raffle is going to be more money. Just so you guys know. Oh, not only that. Look, look what I got for everybody when they come there. Let me show you. I need to show you. Look. <clears throat> a juicer. A massage thing. The leg compressor. And brand new clothes brand new clothes that I get that I got um a while ago that I never used and whoever comes there we're gonna do like a little game like a psychic game and if you win you win one of those prizes there's a fucking juicer in there there's a fucking massage thing in there there's a leg compressor everything there is worth like a hundred dollars and I'm giving them as gifts to people who come when they win that we're gonna play psychic game and whoever gets like the most questions right wins the biggest prize whoever gets the second less questions right gets the next prize like come on now you guys i'm a g and not only that tiktok tiktok right now is about to send me some mad free samples if i get shit that i'm like i don't need this i'm gonna bring those too like you know cameras for the house things like that i'm not cheap <laughs> i'm not cheap I'm not cheap. Look, that's the thing you don't understand. Cause I could, I was gonna sell all these. That would have, would have made at least five hundred dollars off this stuff that I'm giving away. But I decided I'm gonna give them as gifts for people at my retreat. <laughs> okay? Cause I'm a G like that. That's what I do, baby. Get, get your ass out of there. It's dirty. I said don't go there. Luna, no, baby, it's cocky. Okay, my mama. Look at you. Oh my God. Look at her. Luna, look. Look at mommy. <laughs> She's a mess. Mom, oh my God. Please wipe her down. Go, go inside. Go inside. Go. Go inside. Oh my God. She's a mess. Wipe her down. So yeah, I'm excited, man. I'm excited. I want you guys there. So like I said, I'll work with people if I have to. And that's that, you know? Yeah, I just started getting samples from TikTok. I, I work that out. Like some of them pay me, but mostly like they just give me the samples and then I have to like, isn't it crazy? Why does my hair look red, reddish up here? Oh no, it's not. I think it was just that lighting. My hair looks good. It's, it's getting healthier and healthier because that shit was a fucking a mess like three years ago. I fucked it up from cutting, dyeing, and all that. And that rice shampoo and stuff is really helping me. Yo, dry shampoo is the devil. <laughs> it's like, what? That shit is magic. I used that dry shampoo in my hair. Yesterday, I went to um to do a, like a bid. To ch my stepfather does um construction. And I went there. Look at my ear. It's burning. And I went there to... um 
like to sign in for him and stuff so if you sign in like you get the job like the construction job there was all these guys there and shit and one of the guys was kind of cute and i was flirting with him the whole time and, and like i took a picture of the signing and his number was there he's like oh he's a creature of my number i'm like no <laughs> but i was like is he trying to say call me like is because you know i haven't flirted in a long time so i wasn't getting it i was like he was like text me if you need to i was like okay <laughs> okay <laughs> i get all goofy and shit yeah, it's 807. It's 808 now on 87 tomorrow. 807, 807, 87. I mean, I wish everyone was as humble and supportive like you. I just got a stupid letter from a debt collector saying they plan to sue me for Capital One card that was charged off. It's like, why? No, Maria, right? First of all, first of all, um, fight that. Fight that. And they can't sue you. They're not going to sue you. So fight that, first of all. And second of all, if you want to remove it from your credit, keep writing them letters over and over again saying that someone was using your card at that time and just lie lie thank you brie i wish you were coming brie to the retreat albie i wish you could fucking come to the retreat come on guys I, you know and this, there's still three weeks left so if you guys decide you got the money or you want to come august 24th and 25th mark it on your calendar please okay but i just want to say this besides all that there's such good karma coming for everybody right now like i can feel it in my heart the changes that are coming are for the highest good of so many people and it's going to be so beautiful and so wonderful and things are going to get so much better for you and so much it's going to be so different now like i i could i gotta say though after eight eight like if there's people or or things that you don't want to do no more eight eight has to be the day that you like decide you're not going to do this no more because i said like for the retreat i am going to I want to release a lot of things too and i want people to be able to release a lot and the greatest thing about the retreat is it's on mercury and retro and i'm going to tell you why that's amazing because during mercury and retrograde everything you're having the worst day why i'm sorry baby i love you i'm afraid of it backfire exactly exactly so like i said that's my email for any questions and that's the train station if you think that you can make it out you know, and like I said, if you want to pay 200 now and then right the day before the retreat, you could pay the rest. Or even if you don't have it all right now and you'll have it later, just let me know and we'll see if we can work something out with you guys. I will do another um, raffle so people have another person has a chance to win. However, I have to cover the price of the, the person for the retreat because, you know, I've already been giving too much. I need to make sure I make the money back. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because and then I got to pay the girls and I don't want to pay out of my pocket. I want us to all come together and pay them and me. And everybody's happy, you know what I'm saying? Because otherwise, I know me, I'll take the hit and they'll end up getting paid. And I just made the money back for the Airbnb and then I didn't make any money. And that's not my goal this time. I really was like, I got to make money this time. You know, because I've made money the other times, but it wasn't about that. And this time, it's not about the money either. But we got to be smart business women because as healers, we like to give too much. And sometimes we like fuck ourselves in the ass a lot, you know? Yeah, Taurus as well. Okay, so the reason why it's good on Mercury and Retro, guys, is because when during mercury and retro everything that you like the things that fucked with you and messed you up yeah 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 the things that messed with you and fucked you up like they kept messing with you and messing with you and fucking you up and going back to it during mercury and retro if it comes if something that kept irritating you keep coming back to you and it happens during mercury and retrograde it means that that's the one thing that you're it's one of your toughest lessons that you need to learn and you have to let it go before it keeps following you so this mercury and retro when you come when those of you who are coming to the retreat whether it's on zoom or whatever and i'll go live for a little bit just to show the retreat and what's going on if you let let it go at this time it's not going to follow you no more like we're going to leave everything to nature there i told mother nature i've been talking to her from here saying hey i'm going to bring the people we want to release it okay like i said another thing i'm going to do the raffle so more people can have a chance to win but everybody has to pay 30 dollars each for the raffle Think of it as if you don't win, it's a donation towards the retreat or to me. And so you don't feel like shit about like losing $30. But, you know, that's you're taking a chance when you play a raffle. Some people pay $50 for raffles. And if they win, they win, you know, and one person's going to win anyway. So it's like we're all coming together and helping pay for somebody's retreat. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, I got it. I understand. That's why I'm not doing readings right now. You got to stay away from that. Yes, yes, yes. I had a dream about the devil today. I'm not sure because I was watching the movie and the devil tower card popped up. Sometimes I, yeah, you dream what you're watching, yeah. Colleen, my darling. Try sorting out my finances and getting better with my goals. I'm releasing toxic way of eating and finishing school so I can go to law school. And when you become a lawyer, I'll be your first client. Well, I won't need you, but just in case. 
I love you. You're amazing. I'm in Texas. I would love the Zoom link, but we'll definitely be at the next retreat. Awesome. So I'll, I'm going to, those of you who do want the Zoom link, just do me a favor. Uh, uh, write to me on, on that email and I will send you the places that you could pay and I'll just ask for your phone number so I can text you and you'll just be in a group chat. Nobody's going to talk in it. It's just for the Zoom link. So I don't have like a thousand texts on my phone because my phone is super busy right now. It's all over the place. But if you guys want, it's $55 for the Zoom link, but I'll accept 45 That's the lowest I'm going. Okay. I'm just, I just want to make sure you guys have a chance to, to be there. You know, you will, you will Courtney, you will do that. You will find a buyer and you will close books on these these tools for probate. You will. I will email you and need your lovely energy. I love you. Thank you, baby. I love you guys. For the Airbnb, how much to, did I pay for it or how much are people paying to come? I'm in Jersey. And we'll, well, just letting you know, uh, maybe uh, um, it's four ninety five a person, but you're getting three different healers, lots of sessions, lots of... You know, many reads, work, healing. There's a bunch of stuff lined up. We have like a whole itinerary. It's we're really doing this professionally. However, however, those people who can't afford that towards the end of the retreat, let's say I'm like, okay, we we didn't book the last two people because right now it's filling up quickly. Um, so the last two people, we're still gonna have room for you because we'll just charge you two fifty or two hundred dollars and you can come. You just may not get a bed or you have to sleep on a bed with me or something. It's not gonna be weird. You know what I'm saying too, like towards the end if I'm like you know what we should have booked a little bit more people you know and then those people that do come for 200 the only thing you just might not get a bed to sleep in and you might not get like a full reading by somebody but you'll get don't worry you'll get what you need to get don't worry about it you know what I'm saying so the people that are paying 495 you're basically just helping me pay the Airbnb and then like let's say that's it that's what you're basically doing the rest of it is all me yeah yeah you bring a blow up mattress that's what I'm Bitch, I don't slept in worse places. <laughs> okay? <laughs> Alright, how many times you went to a guy's house and he didn't have a bed? At least once in your life. You're like, fuck it. <laughs> like, you go to a dude's house that you like or something and he's fine. And you're like, I just need to get some dick. <laughs> then you get there and he's got a fucking mattress on the floor. And you get in there you're like, oh my god. And then in your head, you're thinking, I can't. This is so ghetto. What am I doing here? I, got, I should leave. I should leave right now. And then your, your body just says, no, nah, fuck it. <laughs> and, you're, and he looks at you like, I'm so sorry. Like, I just moved in here. There's an air mattress on the floor. You're looking at him like, bro, you done had this air mattress for like a year in here. Stop lying. But then you're like, aw, he's trying. <laughs> you know, then you got to make him eat you out for longer. What the fuck? <laughs> I'd be like, you eat pussy, right? All right, I'm staying. I'm kidding. <laughs> You eat pussy for a long time or like a little? You're like, oh no, I'm gonna eat your pussy all night long. Okay, then, honey, blow up that mattress a little bit more because I'm a little chubby, so you're gonna need a little bit more air in that mattress. And here we go. And then he's blowing up the air mattress and then we laying on it. <laughs> Come on, man. Just because we're bougie doesn't mean we can't be ghetto. <laughs> okay? We just today, though, well, we can't do it. We, we need. We need our men to have, like, their shit together. Because this is not, we're not kids anymore. We're not, like, 20s, 20-year-olds 20 no more. We're, like, 40 now. So, if you still got air matches by now, <clears throat> unless you just moved in there, I just, I, I wouldn't understand completely. But even though some people have their own apartment and their own place, but they don't got the furniture. You ever been to somebody's house, they got a nice house and no furniture? <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> like my house might not be as nice as yours but I got furniture everywhere <laughs> there's couches <laughs> and you know those things you sit on <laughs> you watch TV the motherfucker has to put on his cell phone because he has no Netflix or no TV <laughs> I was like oh we're, oh, we're watching a movie on yeah we're gonna watch a movie Netflix and all that oh okay great we get there and he's like which movie you wanna pick I'm like oh that's, that's gonna project onto the TV like we're gonna be able to watch from the nah it's on my phone oh oh it's on your on your own and then we're sitting next to each other i'm like i can't see i can't see i can't see uh, yeah it's all right lucy it'll come no that's different you just got it i don't pop the view i don't pop the view this is why i guys i want you to come you guys are like my best friends like if you could all come and we could finally meeting fucking have fun together oh my god i won't just have people at my retreat i'll meet friends my soul tribe you know 
and I'll know from there, like, who's going to be in my life after this? Because guess what? You know how many people from the retreat, my first one ever, or that I met, like, years ago just doing a reading? I'm still, like, we're friends now. We talk, like, if something happens in their life, I show up for them or vice versa. You know, I, I, I'm about meeting friends, not about meeting strangers who pay me money for a retreat. That's not what it's about, you know? Because if you do something, I'll support you, too. It is. Jesus led me here for a reason. Jesus is the man. And people like, oh, you, you do readings and, you know, you don't believe in Jesus. I'm like, what are you talking about? Jesus came to me and told me what was happening. Like, he he was like, this is what's going to happen. He showed me the full slate. He showed me that people are using him. Because I would sit around and be like, you ever did this? Like, sat in the car and be like, Jesus, why are people using your fucking name for everything? Do you get pissed off when they use your name? Like, Jesus t told me to do it. No, the fuck he didn't. Stop using Jesus for your own agenda. We know you. We see right through you, buddy. And Jesus loves that about me because I fight for him. I'm like, I'm going to fuck these people up. And Jesus is like, Florina, calm down. Please don't beat anybody up. I'm like, I'm just telling you, I'm so sick of people using your fucking name to make money. To... And he's like, that's why he loves me. And that's why Mary showed herself to me because I yelled for her too. I was like, why the fuck don't they ever talk about you? This is bullshit, Mary. This is bullshit. And she came to me the day after I did that and I had a conversation with her. I closed my eyes and I saw her right there. I was like, <gasps> like literally, you guys, my heart dropped to the floor. <sighs> I just saw Mary. Yeah, you see, because they, they heard me. Happy night, happy night, love and light. Thank you, Stephanie. I love you. Thank you, baby. Yeah, poor Mary. They fucking try to make her sound stupid and shit like that. But Mary, um, Jesus' mom came to me, not Mary Magdalene, right? Yeah, Magdalene is the... Hold, why I mean, I confuse her. Mary... Mary Magdalene is the mother of God. Right? Mother of Jesus. People's gods. Because Jesus tells me all the time, I'm not the God. I am a God to people, but I don't consider myself that. People call me a God and I don't like it because I don't want people worshiping or idolizing me. That's that's not okay. Like, he, he doesn't like that. I just emailed you about the retreat. Okay. I'll check it out. Yes, Caroline. I was talking about how Mary Berry, I love you. Thank you. You want to know some crazy shit? A girl from high school did these. I saw her on Instagram and I was like, she does such nice nails. And I, and I was like, you know, she, she's in, she does nails. She's, it's not even professional. It's a little hood, actually. And I told her, I was like, hey, look. And she was like, sometimes people come and they'll be like, damn, I thought you were in a, a salon. She's not. She does it in her house, in a room, you know? And I went and got my nails done by her and supported her. And I gave her like a $30 tip because I was like, here. And not only that, because I get free shit on TikTok. Look how considerate I am. I mean, I love myself because of that. But spirit tells me I'm too giving sometimes. But it's okay. Um, TikTok send, wanted to send me all these like nail stuff. And I kept denying them. And now I just got like a bunch of nail stuff. And I'm going to give it to her. I was like, yo, I got you some. She's like, Flo, you don't have to do that. And then while I was doing my nails, okay, she kept talking about 555 and all that. And then I gave her mom a reading. And I said something about her mom. And, something, and her mom was like, oh, my God. I know what she's talking about. She started crying. And then, um, uh she her friend called her phone she was like flow she was like tell me you with flow right now bitch are you doing flow's nails and she was like yeah she's like bitch flow i'm watching you right now i'm back i'm slow and I was, it was so cute it was so cute so cute i love that shit all right you emailed also okay i'll check that out guys good things are coming your way regardless of what remember what i said the retreat is august 24th and 25th in wallkill new york where it, up near upstate new york near the woodbury commons <clears throat> and near bear mountain state park so if you know where that is you could type in bear mountain state park if you don't know where it is if you're willing to take the train to near bear bear mountain state park you could put something in that stops near there i will pick you up from the train station and make sure you get back on the train safely i won't leave you until you're on the train i'll make sure you're okay okay we're gonna stay one night sleep sleep there through the night and then the next day if you still want to chill for a little bit we can get in my car we can go to the winery we can get some food we can do whatever get some pizza i know a great pizzeria around me thank you thank you nika thank you baby get yourself to that retreat everyone is good yeah if mary berry didn't just have a baby bless to her that she i i think i what i'm not saying this to like show off but one time i told her you're gonna have another kid i told her that and she did okay because she like she was like having you know I just, i'm telling people for a reason because it's possible for like 10 years the doctors were telling her no and then she had a baby a miracle baby and i'll tell you and if she could come she would but she just had the baby and that's you know she can't just leave the baby um overnight i mean unless she wants to bring the baby i'm more than willing to allow the baby to come but 
as long as you know because she could just you could come with the baby actually if you want i don't mind if you have like a newborn baby i don't mind it as long as you think it's gonna be okay for her and stuff or you know maybe i don't know that's probably hard all right guys so i love you i want to pre she came to all the previous retreats she she has supported me in all the retreats and i love her for that and i always made sure that she left happier than she came in and that's why she's so fucking blessed right now because she has always blessed others not just me she's a kind kind person and she's always been blessed and always blessing others all right guys i love you all right we got okay we got um all the info there if you want to know more about the retreat like i said just email me there okay and i will send you the information i could i'll even text you if you want just email me your phone number if you're interested in coming and you're thinking you're coming then i'll text you so i can you know let you know everything ultraviolet please <clears throat> let make sure you hit me up i'll let you know i know go on baddies listen if they pay me a lot of money and they let me be myself like with my shit and i come in and i'm able to do readings and heal people and cleanse the home with sage it, they want me to go even see the go for a day or whatever it is if they let me do what i do i will but you know they gotta pay me good i'm not gonna go there for cheap because i'm worth more than that okay all right you guys i love you i will see you later okay be good be good boys and girls until then i hope i see i'm gonna pray that you guys are able to you know find a way to come to my retreat and you're there and i get to finally meet all of you because i've been dying to meet you guys okay ultraviolet you heard me everybody i love you guys i love you i love you, I love you guys man I love you. I get emotional i get emotional because you guys are like my fucking i don't know if i was your mom in past lives or something but had to be something i don't know why i love you retards so much you retards so much I don't know why I love you retard so much, but I get emotional. All right. I love you. Let me go. My mom's sleeping. She's knocked out on the couch. All right. I love you guys. I love you. Good night. Okay. We'll come. I'll be, I'll do like readings and channeling and all that this week. Just, you know, give me a minute because I'm still like in the retreat mode and trying to focus. And I, I got to pay attention to everyone and it's not easy, you know, and I got the other girls helping me a little bit. They, they're busy too. So. Just give me a minute. Like, I'll, I'll get back on my shit, but, like, I gotta focus right now, you know? Okay, good night, guys. I love you. Mary Berry, I love you. Give your baby a kiss. <laughs> you're so cute. Colleen, bitch, I know, because you're coming to the retreat. I already know we're gonna be friends forever. I already know that. I already fucking know it. All right, love you guys. Kisses. Good night, guys. Grateful, grateful. Good night. I'll see you guys. Oh, let me show you. This is called grush. It's an Albanian dish. This is called grush. We make this. It's an Albanian dish, and it's fucking the best thing you'll ever eat. It's beans and meat, and it's freaking amazing, yo. It's the, you guys would, would fall in love with this. This is so good. I might actually have my stepfather make this because he makes it the best. I might. Oh, I got an idea. I'm going to make my mom make burak for you guys. Burek, you know the spinach and feta cheese thing, the pie, the like it's like a pie with like the crust, crispy phyllo dough on top. Mm, I'm gonna have her make it. We're gonna make it together. I'll help her. I'll make like three pies. Okay, I love you guys. You have a good night. Okay, yes, with the bread. Exactly. Yes. Come on now, hit him. I'll see you later, alright guys. I love you. Good night.